Now, here's Chief Meteorologist Tony Petrarca with your live Pinpoint Doppler 12 Futurecast. Well, finishing up a pretty nice day. Temps topped out in the mid-40s. Amazing how much ice and snow has disappeared last uh, 24 hours with the milder temperatures. Take a look outside Oakland Beach in Warwick. Mainly clear, a few clouds off in the distance right now. Temperatures cooling back through the uh, upper 30s and low 40s. Clear to partly cloudy in Providence right now at 37. Winds are from the west at 14. Humidity dry coming in now at 59%. Tiverton at 37. Cold air on tap for tonight. I'm tracking a cold front in, across the Great Lakes. So some cold air arriving later. So by tomorrow morning, uh, many areas will bottom out into the uh, low in mid 20s. Smithfield now just above freezing, checking in at 34. So your threat tracker now through the overnight Thursday and Friday. A low level green is mentioned. Uh, we'll take a break from any kind of weather drama or any storminess. So it'll be fairly quiet. You can see the cold air upstream uh, Buffalo 28, Syracuse 29. Certainly nothing extreme as temperatures are eventually dropping down to about 23, 24 by morning. So satellite radar composite showing some patchy clouds coming through right now. The cold front uh, that I'm tracking is across uh, the Great Lakes and you can see uh, behind that uh, gusty northwest breeze is bringing in some colder air and that'll sweep through overnight. So when you wake up tomorrow morning, we're back to that uh, winter chill with uh, temperatures starting off at daybreak in the low to mid 20s. In fact, I'm walking through it hour by hour future cast for this evening at uh, seven o'clock mid 30s skies clearing out temperatures dropping off too. As you can see during the um, late night hours by midnight, 31 under clear to partly cloudy skies. And then tomorrow morning, a definite chill or early risers starting off in the low to mid 20s, uh, colder than this morning on a north breeze coming in at about 5 to 15 miles per hour. And then here's the hour by hour temperature breakdown by tomorrow afternoon, 1 o'clock 36, 3 o'clock dry. We'll call it cold considering it was 45 today, 36 degrees, and by 5 o'clock in the evening, nice sunset and a temperature coming in at around 34. All right, seven-day future cast shows that really the dry weather through really a better part of the weekend. At night is probably the better chance of a, of a rain or a snow shower. So Friday day actually looks dry, but uh, at night I do anticipate uh, some precipitation, some rain and snow showers Friday night ending early Saturday morning, partly cloudy, 47. The weekend has some pretty nice temperatures. The next potential for anything significant as far as a storm is in the late Tuesday, Wednesday time frame, but there may not be enough cold air around. So right now, we're leaning towards more of a rain situation early next week. Stay tuned. Temperatures 30s and 40s and nighttime readings in the 20s and the 30s. The next couple of days look pretty good considering the roller coaster ride we've been on of late. You can download the Channel 12 weather app on your smartphones and on your tablets as well. Colder tomorrow, but uh, nothing too unusual, right? Thank you, Tony. More